or scared. You see, I'm getting kicked and punched. The car pulled up next to me. We sideswiped each other, but they hit my car. I put the car in park. The light was red. I got out of the car. One of the guy, um, African American at the bus stop, said, yeah, that's one of those white boy Trump supporters. And I said, what does that have to do with this accident? I just want to exchange insurance. And then the next thing I know, the guy said, don't worry about it. We're going to beat his ass. And then punches were thrown. And the next thing I know, I had five people on me and I fell to the ground. I was kicked in the head. They were in my car stealing all my stuff. I tried to go to the car. I got hit some more. Uh, I tried to get into a defensive stance to try to ward them off a little bit, hold them back. And then the uh, another guy said, get the car, get the car. And then uh, um, when he started up the car, my driver's window and my child-proof back window was open and I put my arm around it and the guy took off and he took off, he was doing 70 or 80 down Roosevelt, swerving. And he was trying to have me fall off and I knew if I somehow let go I was going to die. It's a predominantly African American neighborhood. They started yelling things about, oh there's one of those Trump white boys. And then I did make a comment and say, what does that have to do with it? So what if I support Trump? You know, he might not speak perfect, I didn't say that to them, but he might not speak perfectly politically correct, but he's the best man for the job. He's the one that's going to bring back jobs, the trade, um, get the people that are here illegally out, um, bring back jobs for people that deserve the jobs, that have been here their whole lives, that might not have a full education and can't get a job. What's happening to America? You're supposed to be able to vote in peace. It's supposed to be part of our democracy. And what happened is I vote for somebody and I get beaten, robbed, and my car stolen, and I have no way of getting my wife to and from work safe anymore. Uh, I'm worried about the neighborhood I live in. I'm worried about uh, getting out of the car if an accident happens anymore in a certain neighborhood.